it's going to look a bit weird because it's going to look a bit weird because of the area I'm in. So I have the because obviously it's on the circular. So, so I have the um, the neck done, and this is where the sleeve will be, which is done in garter stitch. So I've not got too many rows to do now to come down to. Uh, Put those stitches on some waste yarn to carry on with the body but uh, i'm really really enjoying this and like it's a free pattern and she does a series of free patterns on there for uh i think you know aimed at beginners maybe that have not necessarily made these types of garments i think she's got i can't remember now she, there's quite a few and and you know i think thousands of people have made this so it's obviously very popular but uh I just say I love the way you go for the green there, like I know. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I'm really, really loving this. So, and like I said, it's so easy. You just cannot go wrong. You've got two options how to start your jumper. So you can do it the way I have, which is um, you start off with the collar and then go into the, the yoki part. Or you can... Um, uh, pick up stitches after your garment's finished and put your collar in so but you really like this don't you mm. and I've never actually knitted Colin a garment because uh, <laughs> so he, he tends to put holes in a lot of things so I'm thinking do I really want to invest quite a few hours in making a large garment for you <laughs> and he's going to put a hole in it but I might because that was the picture on the front is done in a, a brown and you actually really like that didn't mm. you so i might but i might have to put some extra stitches no well it because no because it actually the sizing on this is fabulous because it, it goes right from naught to six months right up to four times extra large so you know if, if you're looking for something, you know, that does a lot of different sizes. And it, again, it's a pattern that you could, you know, like you think you knit from a baby, uh, for a, a grandfather, to, to yourself, to kid, everything. You know, if you want a one size fits all type of pattern, as in, you know what I mean. That's a brilliant one and free. And you can use all sorts of yarn. Uh, I think she, she, she actually does a four ply version as well, I think. But like I said, this is Aaron. Which I, I forget. What do you call it in America now? Can't remember. Ah, it's gone out of my head. So yeah, so very versatile. So what was I saying? So yeah, I might, but I might have to put a lot of proverbos on. Like you can only wear it in the house. You can't pick the dog up. <laughs> Things that is are, the one though. It's the dog. It is claws, the dog. And drumming when we if we're at drum practice. Because the lug, you've got lugs around the drum. We're, mm. we're both leaders. We're section five drummers, and uh, which is, we're a huge drum troop. And we we well, we're on um, time out at the moment because we all, we always have a break from sort of Christmas to end of February, beginning of March. So, and then you've got the lugs on the drums because you we wear them round our waist and they can catch on clothing. And I think that's what you've done. So it, a lot of it, your drumming costumes got holes in it. So yeah, I'm really, really pleased with that. As like I said, it does knit up quickly and I'm not sure whether I'm going to get it done in time to join Anne's jumper for jumper along. Um, but I'll try. <laughs> 